When you do the virtual thing, it teaches you how far to be away from the the thing that you're going to spray and how to adjust it and how much spray to put on there. And it gives you a closer view before you go out and you mess up and do anything else. Let's pick the motorcycle gas tank. That'll be interesting. And it'll have to be adjusted to your head. It may be on the height, which is that knob in the back like a welding helmet. All right, we'll put the gun in your hand. Okay, stand in front of the panel, I mean the gas tank. Now let's adjust the knobs first. Okay. We'll start with the volume first, the bottom big knob. Open it up. Now go to the top knob and open it all the way up to the fan. Now we're ready. This gun has the same weight and the same feel as the guns we use. It teaches you distance in and out. It also gives you a little bit of speed and lets you practice gun handling technique mainly. We get to see, you know, are we doing it right? Then when we use the actual paint, you've got a little bit of practice. Go to the first coat. All right, I'm going to go to the coverage, and very good. I mean, and then I can take and roll this and look at every angle. Green is perfect, how much you want on. The blue is a little light. It'll still be okay. And as they spray more and more, is it getting better? Mm -hmm. you know, if it's not getting better, then we've got to go back to the coverage and distance. And there's all kinds of cues on this machine for that. That gun handling technique is one of the most important things to get done. So that's, that's got to help. Okay. And we do this every day in paint class. So they get, every day they get a little bit of practice.